uh, achievements. Where is it? Trophy. Ah, okay. Nine thousand eight hundred. Yeah, there's more here. Claim all. Hello. Hmm. <clears throat> Don't tell me it's stuck again. Okay. Ooh, that's a lot. <laughs> okay, that's a lot. No wonder stick. <laughs> what is this? There's too many achievements to claim. No wonder it was stuck. Wow. <laughs> Okay, so now I'm 12,000. Oh, I got it already. <laughs> okay, no, no grind today. Straight away got it already. Alright, what's the car called? Crystal Star Lot. Okay, it's still called Crystal Star Lot. Still the same name. Nice. Okay guys, I'm back in Garena Speed Drifters. So in this video, I'm going to review Crystal Star Lot. Eh? I already got Crystal Star Lot in GSD. But before I review, I'll just uh, I'll just explain how I get this Crystal Star Lot. Now that the achievements update already changed, it has become like this. You can get Crystal Star Lot once you get 12,000 points eh, in total. So I already passed that. Two of these uh, achievements, the Athletic and Game, okay? They exist already before this, uh, before the update. It's just that it's converted to uh, points, eh? glory level points. Yeah, you have to get as much achievements as possible. Okay, so um, do some that are easy to get. Okay, this one I haven't finished. Use an item to stop an opponent from crossing the finish line. That means you have to get first place by stopping someone who's about to finish first place 100 times. So this is basically uh, for item mode. Lah. You are trying to stop someone finishing and you steal the first place before finish. Usually with UFO, Koopi, Rocket or whatever. Okay, <laughs> So yeah, that's an achievement for that. This one I finish. Successfully defend using item 6 times in item 400 times. Okay, this one basically just use shield 6 times. Okay, uh, shield or angel in one game. Eh? In one game, you block attacks 6 times. You do that for 100 times. So basically, just keep playing item lah, okay? You don't have to grind so much. You just keep playing item, you you will get it if you haven't finished. This one, uh, place first after being attacked 10 times. Okay, you get attacked so many times, but you still get first. <laughs> also, I haven't finished. These achievements you can easily get if you keep playing item lah, okay? This one's the same, tornado. Attack 3 at once with a tornado, so you must hit all 3 opponents. For how many times? I think quick race might not. Um, Quick race will work, rank will work, but maybe if you're playing in a room that is not matching, it's just invite people, I it might not work. I'm not sure, but I, the best thing is to just play in quick race or rank. Okay, alright, all these ones I finish. Shoot down opponents from the sky in quick race. Okay, this one has to be quick race. In item quick race, eh? you have to hit enemies who are like flying, eh? like, like still not yet on the ground, you shoot them while they're on the air. That's all, okay. So this one is quite easy to do, but uh, yeah, you need to do 100 times. So I actually finished it a long time ago, see? 2020 already finished this. So yeah, a lot of this you probably already done before this update, okay? Team race with friends, this one surely a lot already done. Get MVP, item, if you play a lot of item, you already done that. Racetrack proficiency, all this also I think most people done. Dominator, okay, Dominator probably not, some people haven't finished. But yeah, just quick race, dominator 100 times. It's quite easy if you are battling opponents who are like NPC. <laughs> Usually if you don't haven't played in a while, then you suddenly quick race. All the opponents are NPC, so that, that way it's easy to get dominator. Usually the comeback, okay, this one, the trick for comeback, uh, you have to be last place, okay? And then you go to first place. Then there's also first place 500 times, that one no problem. Overtake opponents. In quick race, all this 
very easy. Earn every star in campaign. Okay, this is story mode. You have to complete story mode to get this. And also 30 times in a row. This one <laughs> you have to keep getting first. In the start of the game, like you're still just started. This one is very easy. But if you haven't finished this, this might be a problem. <laughs> okay, now for game achievements. This one is couple stuff. Yeah, couple mode. Okay, manuscript. This is the lost manuscript story. If you finish all, you get all this. Couple anniversary. Uh, 250 couple mode. <laughs> this one I also don't play anymore. Okay, the others are all time time records. Eh? And this one is uh, rank. All this clock, clock, clock are all just the achievement in time. And the last one is couple mode. Oh yeah, the Pegasus couple mode. That's all. Okay, so now. The collect achievements and the track achievements. These are the new ones. Eh? Alright, not, not really the new ones. This is still old. Eh? So, still couple intimacy. This is uh, max modified. Okay, max modified doesn't mean you full mod a car. Some, it can mean full mod for both. Like if you have multiple branches, you have left and right. I think you have to mod both. For this one, no need to mod A cars. You can just mod C cars and B cars. That one is very cheap. You just full mod those. This is easily done, okay? This one is also couple stuff. This is honor, okay? This one is just pay to get <laughs> club. Okay, this one, this one is a quite a grind. But if you are, if you have already been in the club for very long, uh, you can get this. Uh. This one took me one year for the third one. Eh? Supreme crown. This is just supreme crown buying. Yeah, this one mostly buying. Costumes. Twelve cars. Well, by now, if you have played it quite a long time, this one should be done already. Level passing 50, yeah. There's most of you already 50 plus or more already. This one, gold should all be done. VIP, well, this one is just pay to win. Nah. VIP, you need to reach 10, 11, 12 to get this. So, that one is I also haven't reached. Okay, so only track achievements is the new one. Eh? Track achievements is uh, a lot of stuff that are. Quite unusual. Pass through small animals. Okay, <laughs> five hundred times in matches. Okay, so in matching only. Eh? Uh, quick race. Uh, sorry, quick race is included. Rank is included. But playing solo doesn't include. Eh? Pass through small animals. I think uh, it has to be like like. Well, in Colo Cathedral, there's like pigeons, for example, right? Something like that, lah. When you pass through, they fly away. That kind of animals. I don't know if there's any rabbits or what around. I remember, yeah, there's dogs in the... Uh, what's it called? This map. Okay, this map. <laughs> there's uh, a lot uh, There's a lot of uh, animals running around when you pass through them, for example. That is what you're supposed to do. Uh. You just pass them, you trigger the animation of them running away. Uh, that is counted uh, the small animals that you have to pass through. So you have to go pass them through 500 times. <laughs> Basically, you have to play that map many times uh, okay and it has to be matches so you cannot just simply play solo and count okay now pass through vehicles this one um, I'm not quite sure what are vehicles in this I thought it was the launch pad but sometimes I thought it was the train like what else are vehicles here <laughs> I'm thinking let me see what 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 other stuff are you passing through like vehicle is there like other cars like I thought maybe the train right but uh, yeah, <laughs> this these are all completed during May, July, November of this year, which uh, is already the achievements are already here, but we don't uh, see this achievement until now. <laughs> so yeah, basically I already cleared it already by November. Eh? November I finished it already. But yeah, I'm not quite sure what are the vehicles here, but I've already done them. Depths of time, pass through statues. Okay, statues. There is the Asian Cup statue. That one, I guess, is counted. What other statues are there? The statue has to be like you are passing through that. So the only statue I can think of is just the Asian Cup map. Eh? There might be more, but yeah. The only thing I can remember is the Asian Cup map. You can pass through that statue. That counts. Eh? Alpha fan, it has to be an alpha designated track. That means uh, I think it's only alpha season. When alpha season, when you when you are in rank, but they say rank or match, uh, rank or match race, eh? so it has to be an alpha designated map. That means in your rank, there is a map that is uh, alpha map bonus or something like that. Usually lah, so you have to get that kind of map, and uh, you also have to get first place. So yeah, I have to find. <laughs> 
Wait, I'm not sure if have, it has to be Alpha Season first or you can just simply go for that map. Polaris Friend, okay, this one I just need three more. I probably think, uh, not sure if it had to be Polaris Map, like we know what a Polaris Map, right? Like the Music City, Music Factory. But does it have to be a Polaris Season first to be counted? That one I'm not sure. Because I'm pretty sure it should be done already because I already played quite a lot of Polaris uh, maps. Endless possibilities, this one actually first place in the third race segment. Okay, segment means on your map and when you are playing uh, whatever map. There's at the bottom of the mini map, there's like a, a line, right? That splits in the, the map into three, okay? So there's also like a timer before it goes to the next segment. So on the third segment, that means before you finish, on the third, you are first place. On the third, until the finish, you are first place, I think. That's what it means. So they ask you to achieve first place on the third race segment. That's that they want you to get first while on the third third part of the map. There's also first and second somewhere. Later I'll find it. Traveller. Pass through landmarks. Okay, landmarks I'm not quite sure so. But I think it's like uh, famous places maybe? Like Colon Cathedral you pass through a building. I'm not sure so. I, I always think of Colon Cathedral or maybe Nostradstein because they are like uh, real life places right? Uh, so maybe you are just passing through specific uh, famous places lah. famous places in the real in real life uh, kind of maps so like Nuschenstein Kolo Cathedral uh, yeah, I, that, that's all I can remember maybe all the way to Kian also so but I'm not sure what is the landmark they mean here <laughs> but it says uh, mountains and rivers I don't know it can be anything with one drum beat drum beat what's this Okay, this is the first race segment. Okay, just now I said the third one. This is the first one. Eh? Number one, I think this one's second. Eh? Oh, no, no. Okay, this one's super difficult tracks. It's basically maps with. I'm not sure four star counts, but five star, six star, seven star. You just get first. That's it. So you need to play the difficult maps and get first. Ah, uh, this is the second. Uh, sec water areas 500 times in matches. Okay, this one's uh, maps with waters. Uh. This is basically. Like the amusement park map, uh, that one got water, you go underwater and then you go back out. There's also the item map where you go underwater. Yeah, all those maps that you go underwater and come out, that one lah. Okay, this one passed through plague, so plagues are also like famous, famous locations. So this, this and landmarks are quite uh, similar. So yeah, I'm not sure which is which though. Sticking is a must. Now this one is, uh, you have to stick to the limit. I think sticking near to the wall is what I think it means. Huh? Stick to the limit 5 times, 10 times, 15 times. On July, I've, I completed this. So I think, yeah, it, it says here, beautifully sticking to the curves. That means you have to be very close to the wall while drifting 15 times. So, what I suggested, huh? uh, I, Sanyu asked me this as well. Just maybe play City 11 and get close to the wall. Yeah, maybe have to break a bit and no need to rush because there's no timer. You just have to keep sticking to the wall. But for Sandy, it didn't work. So I'm not quite sure how close do you, do you want it to count as a uh, stick to 15 times. So <clears throat> staring to the abyss, this one, some people are saying uh, it might not work. But yeah, you have to fall into the death zone 100 times. Death zone means wherever you uh, when you fall down, uh, automatically reset, right? You don't need, you need to press reset. It will reset by itself because you're out of bounds. That kind of uh, out of bounds zone. So you just have to fall down like that 100 times. <laughs> I'm surprised that uh, mine hasn't finished that. So it might be you have to finish the race still or I'm not sure. How will it count? Eh? Dominate, okay you just have to get all 5 trophies in 70 maps. Case of the racing god, this one you have to battle racing gods but now we don't see that in rank anymore. So probably cannot progress this anymore, <laughs> I'm not sure. We don't have the battle uh, Munich. Mira in rank or whatever used to have but now don't have so I don't know how this works now Troy fan just basically Troy map okay secret explorer okay these are easter eggs you just enter uh, different easter eggs and if you count I'm not sure if you enter the same easter egg it will count but basically just find any easter egg in whatever map uh, city is city uh, whatever like Eden Valley that's an easter egg right Gold, the golem map, 
some of the old maps have easter egg you can just go in there it will count okay bidding towards tomorrow just acceleration zone pass through shortcuts this one just shortcuts at the peak of the ladder this one you just need 400 trophy even i haven't reached that so we need to wait for more maps uh, to reach 400 Reno fan i don't even have progress i think this one because uh, there's no Reno map the uh, the the water random maps and maybe that one is what you need to be counted because i have zero and they don't release those random maps so i don't know maybe that's why and this one bounce i'm not sure what this means trigger bounce that's basically all the, the achievements uh you should do eh? so whatever you can do just try to do that eh? okay all right that is for <laughs> achievements just to let you know how to get uh, Crystal Star Lot, okay? So yeah, that, that's all for Crystal Star Lot on how to get. Now let's review it. You can also check my other video on uh, how I got Crystal Star Lot on QQ, okay? I'll share that in the video later. Alright, <laughs> anyway, back to Crystal Star Lot. Okay, Crystal Star Lot has three different diamond uh, crystal abilities here. Only one of them will activate. The characteristic is uh, while drifting, nitro gas is immediate Im uh, generated immediately when the end tank is full. That means when you your end tank is not full yet, when you drift and it reaches hundred percent, it automatically becomes nitro. But it doesn't continue like crystal nova or SPX or ISO. It doesn't do that. Right? It just stops once it's hundred percent. You get the, the nitro. And every time you start the game, one of the three characteristics will take effect at random. So this is gacha. Basically, the, the the luck is just uh, one of the three will activate every time the race starts. Okay, it won't it won't be all three. It will just be one out of three. So the first one. Okay, there we go. All right. So the first one is if you have the this color. Okay, this is the purple color. I guess you can say every time double boost is used. Every time you use double boost. There's a chance that you gain N tank 3.5% for 8 seconds and minibus max speed plus 5.2 km per hour and minibus power plus 12%. Second one, the slightly darker purple. Within 36 seconds of starting, you get 5.7% N tank per second and nitro max speed plus 5.6 km per hour and nitro power plus 20%. And the last one, the blue color, this one's the best one. When being overtaken or overtaken, there's an 88% chance, so it's a high chance there. Eh? You gain 57% N-Tank immediately, that's more than half of the N-Tank within 6 seconds and base max speed plus 5.2 km per hour and base power plus 30% so very powerful ability here and it will activate when every time you're overtaking or overtaken so yeah, uh, if you have activated the blue one, you're lucky and it has to be uh, Versus lah, doing versus, okay, like overtaking, overtaken. The other two, okay, this one is just early game ability, and the other one is just every double boost you get a buff ability. Okay. So yeah, even though this car looks like a D car, like the default <laughs> uh, new beast right car, it is actually an A car. It's not a skin, eh? It's a totally an A car. So uh, I've got to check the modding, but it's okay. This is already full modded. Let me test straight away. Okay, which characteristic we get first? Let's see. The purple one. Okay, purple one is uh, early game. Alright. So, normal speed, 203. Double boost, 247.5. I... Hold on, let me re retry that again. Okay, here we go again. No pet this time, no ECU. And we got purple again. Okay, still early game. Uh, double boost is 247.3, still same. Normal speed is 202. Not 203. 202.8. Okay, that's slightly different. Eh? CW 317.5. Still the same, like just uh, during stream. Eh? WCW is 299.7. And WCW will be 322. <laughs> okay, now the early game ability is gone. We check one more time. Normal speed is still the same. Double boost. 
247.3 still the same CW 311.9 still good without the ability WCW 294.1 and WCW 316.4 so yeah this car is like faster than most A cars even diamond car and this car is free it's just you need to grind for the achievements <laughs> okay let me try again and try to get the other characteristics so you can see the difference eh? uh, still get the early game is it only early game in here whichever ability Okay, this one didn't activate, so I think this might be the third one or the first one. We'll see. Okay, it's the first one. So first one is the double boost activator. So CW three one six point one when they activate. WCW okay didn't activate. So it's a bit hard to activate when double boost. Okay, there you go. WCW. 296.2 and WCWW 321.1 still faster even when it activates but yeah the double boost one a bit hard to activate 316.1 okay and the third one I cannot because uh, I need op opponents to overtake Okay, so that's the characteristics eh? for Crystal Starlot. Almost broken in speed compared to Diamond Cars, but it's free car. Okay, even though this car's speed is quite broken and <laughs> it's a free car, it isn't as meta as the main uh, A cars. Eh? Okay, so let me just compare with the Hades I reviewed last time in City 11. Eh? If I get overtaking ability, that would be great because even replays are counted. Eh? Let's see which one we get. Which one is this? Ah, it's the first one. So double boost. Okay, I'll try one more time. <laughs> I messed up at the start there. So yeah, maybe I'll get something else. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll get the third one this time. Which one is this? Still the first one, okay. Yeah, so... For speed, it's still fast, but... The controls make it feel like it's not an A-car. But the abilities are very good. The ability and speed is good. I can still catch up. Yeah, I can catch up with Hades. And as you realize, uh, every time the tank full, I instantly get that nitro. Eh? I don't have to end the drift. Okay, I don't have Nitro here, but I can just, as you can see, I can still see the W, even uh, when I don't have Nitro, the Nitro just comes a bit late. <laughs> ah! Wait a minute! Okay, I, I messed up there. Ah, I can catch up. Okay, I, I made a mistake there, but it's still good. Okay, I won't say this car is like Isola, okay? But you can still get a uh, Nitro just like Isola. Just your end tank isn't as good like Isola.
You can still get anything. Uh, you can still get nitro when it's full, but not as good as I saw. All right. Okay, first thing I can say. Oh yeah, I got the third ability. Okay, that's good. So this one helps me get a lot of uh, anything while I'm being overtaken or overtaken. I miss. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah. Okay. I guess the issue with this car is the drift and turn. Hey! I forgot this is not QQ. GSD I uh, to press two times there. Or better spam. Okay, now I cannot activate some more because all the opponents at the back. Maybe in rank can, but now it's a bit tough to find rank. I'll try later. Huh? Oh, what? I activated. That's impossible, I'm first. How did that happen? No. Okay, yeah, quick race is too easy, but this is where you can uh, farm your dominator achievement if you haven't done. <laughs> okay, I give up. I cannot find rank. <laughs> Supreme and legendary, very hard to find. Especially if you are playing solo speed. Okay, maybe I'll try team speed. Just, uh, I'll give another try. If it's taken out, maybe I'll go back to quick race. Six and a half hours late. Hey, yeah, I fall asleep <laughs> waiting for this matching. All right, never mind. I guess uh, night time we have more people. All right, then I'll just play some more Call of Cathedral. Why not? So yeah, here I think you can count the vehicles one and the landmarks or plagues. I'm not sure the plague counted for for farming achievements. Ah, uh, if you're trying to finish up an achievement, this map maybe you can. Because Cologne Cathedral is based on Germany. It's a real place. Right, which ability do I get this time? Um, I think that's the early game one. Okay, this is the second one. Eh? Oops. Hey. that I can say that it feels like the D card itself for turning and drifting it but everything else is so good ability uh, speed that doesn't mean I can cannot get first still can get first no problem <laughs> And okay, I think that will be it for this video. So yeah, Crystal Starlord, no gacha required. You, this is not a pay to win car, this is, car is totally free and it's stronger than uh, than most diamond cars by speed. Eh? By speed, it's faster than most di diamond cars. But this turning and drifting feels like it's the same as the basic D car, I believe. If we compare newbies right with this car, Mmm, okay, not, not drifting now, but the drifting uh, is average, eh? but the turning feels the same like the usual newbies, right? Okay, <laughs> but everything else, yeah, it's like it's like a uh, 
better version of newbies, right? The A car version of newbies, right? Lah, basically, okay. But it has characteristics. The characteristics is like a gacha. You get one out of the three. You might get a double boost, uh, chance activate. Early game ability activate or overtaking overtaken activate. The best one is the third one, <laughs> and this one always got instantly get nitro once your end tank is full. You don't have to end the drift to get the nitro, so you can see the W even when you don't have nitro. Okay, similar like ISO, but not as like ISO. <laughs> okay, Crystal Star Lot, no payment required. Just do the achievements. You need to grind a bit lah for this, for the 12,000 eh? You have to reach 12,000 to get the car. Okay, that's it for Crystal Starlot. Second time review. If you want to see my QQ review, I'll uh, give a link uh, on the left or right, okay? In the end of this video. So that's it for this video guys. Thank you guys for watching. See you guys next time.